All right, guys, we're going to have a really, really brief discussion today on this whole mask situation for the uh, COVID-19. Take this pot off the hanger here. It's clanking in the breeze. But anyway, I wanted to have a brief talk with you guys today about this whole COVID-19 situation and the mask shortage situation and how there are a lot of videos showing people how to make masks just like this one, okay? These videos are nothing new. They've been around for years because these do make excellent dust masks. And at work, if I don't have access to these, that's what I do. Now, you see a lot of people out in public also wearing the surgical Just like so, right? But a lot of you have got the notion in your head that wearing this, wearing this, or wearing this is going to keep you from getting sick. Well, first of all, that is not true. That is not the case at all. While it may help to keep you from catching certain things, none of this works against COVID-19. The only mask recognized by the CDC to stop COVID-19 from infecting you, if you're wearing it, is the N95. Nothing else. I will put the link to that down in the description of this video so you can look for yourself. But only the N95. Okay? Now, there's a reason, like, you say, well... I've seen on video a million times all these Chinese running around in general pop with mask on just like this one, okay? But what some of you aren't understanding is that this mask isn't to keep them from getting sick. This mask is because they are already sick and they are doing their part in trying to keep everyone else around them healthy. Because what this mask is actually for is to keep you from transmitting something to another person or a patient. That's why you see nurses and doctors and things like that wearing these masks. If you're a surgeon or if you happen to be the anesthesiologist or whoever and you're in the OR and you've got a patient under the knife, the last thing you want to do is cough or sneeze on an open area of the body and contaminate the inside of the body cavity in any way. So that's why they wear the masks. The masks aren't for their protection, it's for the patient's protection. When you got this on, this will stop a cough, it will stop a sneeze, and it will keep you from spewing and contaminating a large area in front of you, okay? But if you happen to be in an area where COVID-19 is active, this does not stop you from contracting it. That is the first thing you guys got to realize. Neither does this. Okay? Neither does this. And I'll tell you what, even though this looks like a good idea, I'm using rubber bands like a lot of videos show you, and you can't wear this mask for more than just a few minutes because those rubber bands will start cutting in right here behind your ears, and it hurts like hell, all right? So, yes, even this mask is good for dust. It's a great dust mask. I use it at work all the time, like I said. And if I'm wearing this, if I'm sick, if I've got a cold or even the flu, influenza, if I'm coughing and sneezing, this will prevent me from being able to, you know, from making anyone else sick who happens to be in my immediate vicinity. But it's not for my protection, it's for theirs, okay? So these things are not going to make you any less likely to get COVID-19 if you're out shopping. You know, you can't go out into the grocery store and walk down an aisle that's got seven people in it and say, hey, I got my mask. I'm golden, okay? I'm good to go. It's okay now for me to walk down here and grab that can of pork and beans because I'm wearing a mask. 
absolutely dead wrong, okay? Do not make the mistake of thinking that this mask is for your protection. It is for their protection, not yours. All right, guys, if you've made it through the video this far, thank you very, very much for watching. Uh, I thank you guys very, very much for your view time and questions and comments. Drop those down below. You guys know I'll always get back to you. Uh, if you haven't yet, subscribe to the video. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, rather, not the video, but the channel, uh, reach over there and hit the notification bell. Select all notifications if you'd like to get notified when I upload future videos. Questions, comments, drop them down below, guys. Thank you very, very much for your views and for your support. And I'll get another video out as soon as I can. See you on the next one.